hello everyone welcome to key to blogging and in this video i will show you how can add watermarks to your images inside your wordpress website so if you are working in the field of images or any type of design work then you should put a watermark to all of your images to prevent copyright and you can easily claim a images if someone using it without your permissions so you don't have to do it manually to add a watermark in all images you can use a plugin to add watermarks inside your wordpress images easily so let's go to the dashboard and let's check how you can add your watermark in images so let's go to dashboard and i will go to plugin and i will click on the add new button here and here i will search for like easy watermark now you need to install this plugin easy watermark so let me just install it okay now the plugin is installed let me just activate this plugin first now i will click on setting here and you can also go to tools and click on easy watermark here and let's keep it as it is so you can take a backup so that it will not affect your original images so let's click on save changes now let's go to the tools here and let's click on watermark here and let's click on add new watermark and you can also add a title like my watermark or you can add anything here and let's add a text watermark in images so you can add the text like i want to add key to blogging as a watermark and you can also select the image and upload your image as a watermark so in this case i am using a text as a watermark and you can also change the font of the text and you can also change the color so let me just keep it like red and you can also adjust the text size so let me just decrease the text size to around 15 pt and you can also adjust the opacity so let me just adjust the opacity to something like 80 percent and you can also select the position so i will add my watermark at the top right hand corner so i will select this position like this and you can also select the applying rules so i will select thumbnails and i will select all the images from here and I think everything is okay so let me just click on select preview image so let me just click on here and set as preview image and as you can see the watermark is added at the top right corner like this so let me just save this now let me just go to the front end and let me just refresh this page because it will add the watermark whenever you upload a new images so for this we are going to the plugin and let's click on easy watermark here and i will click on tools here and i will select the bulk watermark feature so let me just select my watermark here and i will click on start so it will start adding the watermark to all of your images and as you can see currently it has changed it to around 20 percent so let's wait for 100 percent okay now it has uh, added the watermark to all of our website images and you can also restore it to your original position by clicking on the restore button because we have set the backup option here so that you can easily restore your previous images so as the bulk watermark process is done so let me just go to the front end and let me just refresh this page and as you can see the watermark is added at the top right hand corner so you can adjust the watermark color you can adjust the watermark size and position just by clicking on the watermark here and let's click on edit here and here you can adjust the text size so let me just reduce it further to like 8 pixel and you can change the opacity and let's add a top offset so let me just top offset to like something 3 pixel and it will add a spacing from the top so let's change it to something like 10 pixel okay 
now let me just update this now let's click on the image and as you can see it has added the offset like this so let's click on here now let's go to the easy watermark option and let me just click on tools here and let me just click on restore button here so it will restore our original images in the front end so let's wait for this processing to done okay now it has restored our previous images so let me just go to the front end and let me just refresh this page and as you can see it has restored our original images so in this way you can add watermarks increase the size change it colors and you can change the position and you can set the top offset in the top right corner so you can basically customize the watermark and the way you want and you can if you want to restore it to the original position then you can click on the restore button so in this way you can add watermarks to your wordpress website and prevent your images from copying by other people so if you found this video helpful then make sure to hit the like button and do subscribe key to blogging for more upcoming videos like this and i will see you in the next video thank you